Alright guys, this was the little bit of a surprise I had for you guys, uh, as we are trying to step into different realms. Uh, I tried to do Doom tonight, I have a problem with my disc reader, and it did end up downloading, but then when I tried to play it, it just kept freezing, and I think it's because I don't have enough space, but it didn't tell me that, so the Doom 93 will happen probably as soon as the 2k18 finals are done uh that was what i was looking forward to doing tonight but we're going to go ahead this is a, a very small game that it was easy to download onto the system um i tried to figure a little bit of it out earlier but like it is it, it you have to we're gonna go ahead and do a pro hunt and it says the name of the game as you can see when we go back pro deer out west hunting or is it pro deer hunting out west? I don't know. But the fact that Kentucky's in here, that makes me wonder. Because that's not out west. But that's where we're going to head first. Because that's closest to my home. I hate when the cord does that. Okay. So we are either Turkey Ridge Tract. Plenty of oak thickets, food plots, and deer. Or Big Buck Hollow Tract. Open rolling hardwoods, large pastures, and big bucks. Let's go there. We can use a 3006 rifle, a 3030 rifle, a pump shotgun, which I'm not going to do, a muzzle loader, or a boat. I think we're going to use the 3030 rifle. Uh, I don't know. I like the scope on a 3006 rifle. Let's go with that to start with. Objective harvested target inches 0 300. Now, what that stuff means, I don't know. But. We will figure it out. And if I was very loud today on the finals for the NBA uh, final game that I did on my channel, I apologize. Once again, the mic was too close to my face. I've done that like twice now. Once for a baseball game. Or I think it was once for racing. Now this game is kind of odd. I don't know exactly what I'm supposed to do to go find deer. So what, basically the beginning of the game, you I'll show you the controls. And I accidentally fired earlier and probably scared every deer off in that area. So that's why we're restarting here. I would have just jumped right into it. But initializing scene. Okay, we're out in the woods. We're hunting, of course. And we also can get in trees. Now here's, here's us. You kind of look around. Yeah, that bullet looks absolutely old and terrible in that corner. But okay, oh well. Now, here's your buttons, R1 to raise your gun and lower, R2 to fire your gun. You can use binoculars with L1, L2 is a play calls, use gear. You can enter and exit tree stands, which we don't, I don't know, uh, I don't know if this game has like a, like a career or like, I mean, I don't know. You can move them, look around, reload gun. I wonder if there's any, and there's your GPS, of course, if you hit circle, but it doesn't really tell where you're located. Yeah, it does. Yeah, it does. I just found that. I didn't see that last time I played. Okay, so, yeah, right there we are, and you see all the area around us here, and there could be a lot of area for deer, so we are going to go ahead and pull our weapon up. There's how you pull the weapon up. I'd much rather have a scope, which is not lined up with the actual eyesights, but okay, it's fine. This game was really cheap, and I bought it for the channel, channel only. And then you hit L1 to put the gun away, L2 to shoot. So there is no crouching, but you can also change, like if I wanted to make a grunt call. Hang on, let's get out of it. You can switch things, like I can put this stuff on my body by hitting, I think it's this. Yeah, see I put the, the smell stuff on there, and then... What was it that I, what did I, oh, I forgot, okay, yeah, this. This is kind of hard to figure out. I don't really have to do the binocular since it's an automatic thing. So we, we pick that, and then you hit that, and you get a grunt call. You hear it? There we go. A little bit of grunting here. I wish they had a crouch. I don't know if these are a tree stand that we can put up somewhere. I don't know. I haven't seen anywhere that I'd want to put one up yet, but maybe over this ridge. I wish they had a crouch button. I don't get that. This is a hunting game. You want your guy to crouch. You don't just want him up running around. 
even prone position. Sometimes in hunts, you have to go in prone. I mean, you definitely don't want to... You got to wear a bright yellow vest and deer can see. We're going to head down this ridge here. I'm looking for a deer. I'm looking for a hunt and a deer. Hopefully a nice big buck, but even if it's just a doe, I will be happy with our first episode. So we're going to slowly... I'm not walking very fast. That way I don't make a lot of noise. And see, the trees are so small, you can't even hide behind them. I was going to get a different hunting game, but I cannot find it anywhere, the one that I wanted. This one was so cheap, I just was like, you know what? I'm looking here. I'm just looking, guys. What did it say? I can put a tree stand up? Okay, so you can put a tree stand Okay. So could we go back to the top of the ridge here and put a tree stand up at one of these trees? Yeah, you sure can. That's cool. That's something I just learned. All right, so let's go put our tree stand up in this bushy tree over here that's right on the top of the hill. And that way we can kind of watch. Yeah, okay, it's not giving me the option for this tree. There we go. We'll just do this tree. Okay, I did. Let's just climb up. Is the tree stand this is a very odd game okay so we'll say this is our tree stand oh this is terrible this... I'm trying to see if one will come down there in the ridge but now we're kind of in the bushes and now my binoculars aren't coming out so for that I guess I'm gonna have to do this And then do this. Or not. There we go. That's a slow moving guy. This guy here. See if you guys see any deer anywhere down in that ridge. There's so many bushes and trees in my way. This was a terrible place for a tree stand. How do you exit? Enter, exit. Okay. Well, we're going to try to go exit here in a minute and go try to go somewhere else because obviously one thing this game has is lag and lots of it. So that's probably what's so cheap. And it was probably made by a company that's not really all that. I can't zoom in or nothing. I, um, all right. Well, I don't see nothing there. Let's put those away. Let's climb back down. That's okay. Let's get back on the ground. Alright. Uh, exit, please. Can we exit? I don't want to be in this. Okay, yeah. There we go. Alright, we need to slow down because even if I don't have a tree stand and I run into a deer somewhere, we don't want to be acting all wild. Ah, uh, it's going to pull my binoc. No, it didn't. Let's go back to our grunt call. I've already done the smell stuff. I don't have to do it a bunch. God, I wish we could crouch in this game. I just feel like they're going to see me. Do you think if we get on this ridge here and put a tree stand up in that tree over here, is there like a hill that goes downward where we could see deer? I would like to get my first hunt and kill on, you know, the first video. That would be kind of cool. But there's a chance this video just is going to be a video of us walking around. Look at, uh-oh. Okay, that's, that's just power lines or something. Or fence. That's a fence. So, basically everything ahead of me looks like a hill because of fill-in. And that means that the person that made this game 
probably didn't have a lot of money to make it but loved hunting so we're gonna give it a shot it does look very laggy very there is no jump so we can't go okay so this is probably the border of the map uh, where, which one was the map there it is okay so it is the border of the map it's the end of where we can go we got so much though let's just kinda sneak around here I wanna see if we even see one deer I ain't gonna kill no birds even though they're flying all over the place but now we're right in a wild open field and I do that that's real smart let's get back in these woods over here and there is no running in this game so you basically have to slowly walk everywhere you go but we're about to be in a deer area it doesn't really tell you on the GPS what is the most dearest area so this is really like an open world you have gotta find the deer yourself uh, kind of realistic in that sense uh, graphics aren't that great but it's not too bad it's not something I can't deal with especially on a gaming monitor uh, I just don't see an area that I feel comfortable putting a tree stand up I don't want to be downhill with a tree stand and then look uphill that's stupid you want to be as high as possible and see as much as possible if you're gonna hunt for deer uh, let's go back over here let's put some more of this stuff on alright we did that part and let's go back to our grunt call just so I have it ready and don't forget you've got oh I thought I seen something over there we're just kind of looking around. This is called a pro hunt. They also have action hunts on this game. And we'll try that out too. Especially if we don't get nothing done here. I'm just, I'm not really following a GPS right now because I don't know where to actually look or what the GPS is trying to tell me. But I am trying to find a place to put a good, decent tree stand so I can look down into a, a gully gully somewhere. I thought that was a deer. It was just a tree stump. I mean, this might be the most boring video I've ever done in my life, but at least I'm trying new things for the channel. Oh, we're just walking the whole border. I mean, that's ridiculous. I have pretty much, this is in Kentucky, and we have yet to run into any animals but birds. Oh, they had this one uh, hunting game that has bears and stuff. I can't wait to get that for the channel. We just got to kind of sneak around till we can see us a deer, I guess. Maybe, is it a waiting game? I, I don't want to sit here for an hour and make you guys sit here and watch. I see a deer, I see a deer. I see a whole bunch of deer they're all down here in this gully I just seen them running though and I don't know what they're running from but we just seen some deer I don't know if you guys caught it but I did they were running across this field over here or this opening So what I want to do is I'm going to go to this front tree. Set up a tree stand. It's not, yep, it's going to let me. Very slow climb, but there are some deer out here. All right, perfect. We're going to keep it there. No, go down one. I think it already took us down one. They're saying this is perfect. Okay. Alright, just kind of look around here with me, guys. I've seen some deer running. So I want to switch to the binoculars. Ah, i got to get used to these buttons. 
Alright, let's use them. I don't know why the binoculars are L1 and everything else is L2. I've seen them running around this way. Boy, this is sensitive. And there is no zoom. See, these binoculars are cheap, obviously. We were not very prepared for this hunting trip. And the deer that I saw are gone for now. Now, I'm not going to sit in a tree stand for 30 minutes waiting on a deer to come across. That is not the type of video I'm going to do. Okay. So, let's put those away. Let's climb back down. And next time I see them, I'm just going to stay on the ground. Why did it say that was a good spot? I don't know. See that yellow right there? That means you're in a good spot. Let's let go. Alright. I don't know, guys. There goes one right there. There goes one right there. They're just running so much. Why don't they stop and eat? Alright, I see it. Somebody see where it went? Boy, this is sensitive. They just run and run and run. They don't stop for nothing. He's got to be around here somewhere. I just seen him. And there is no tracking in this game. You basically just got to find the deer. All the stuff that most hunters would use is not in the game. Now, maybe an action hunt it is. I don't know. But in pro hunt, no. Uh, no. I want to go back to my grunt call. Can I do that, please? I want to leave the gun out because I think there's a deer over here and we want to get him. getting a little hairy in here foggy oh we've seen like th I've seen three or four deer so far and yet to even get a chance to shoot at them because they stay moving they don't slow down I guess I'm too close to them maybe maybe I'm scaring them off I don't know check up the ridge there it's just real foggy right now Um, alright, let's go up the hill here. I don't think the deer that we were after is anywhere in the vicinity. But I do know there are deer out here. But I don't think there is any... Let's do this tree stand here. One, two, three. Where's the best? Right here. Okay. All right, now we should be able to get a pretty good look down through that way. And instead of using the binoculars, I'll have this thing on the ready. It's just starting to get so foggy. There's probably like six deer over there. See how sensitive it is? You barely touch it and it's just continuously moving. And it floats with your breath. Okay, guys. So we may not end up getting any deer on the first video of this. But we're learning. Let's check around this side. Let's put the gun away for a minute. See if we see anything. I think us walking was causing them to run. But they should stop and feed. 
If the game was a little more realistic, maybe they would. I guess what we could do is pull out the binoculars. Or let's just do the grunt call. For now. Because I know there's one over here. We've seen him. Obviously, he's over here. You don't overdo that because that will scare them off. Um, not seeing any motion yet. I'd just like to get one shot off. I hear something. And it's not us. We're up in a tree stand. There's a deer nearby somewhere. Just take a look. Right there, right there, right there, right there. We got one. Oh my gosh, this gun is insane. <laughs> Okay, I think we got a piece of him. Did we get a piece of him? Look like we got a piece of him. Now let's put that away and let's go look. We just scared every other deer in the area off. Was he going this way? Can we follow? Is it on the GPS where I shot him? Did we get him? I seen stuff flail off of him. I tried to get him in the back of the neck, but the gun is so sensitive. So we're just kind of hunting around for the deer that we shot at. Did he make it to the top of the ridge? Or does she? Did we not get it? I mean, we may have not got it. There is no tracking. As you can see, no tracking. Look around, reload movement. There is no tracking in this game. So, blood trails that you see on other games like Red Dead or all the cool games in the real world of hunting are more realistic than a hunting game. I'm not seeing any deer carcass or blood or anything. So what we're going to do, I always think you can run when I do that. Sorry, guys. I thought we got one. I'm going to set up a tree stand, move back up the tree, try this again. I don't know where he went, but next time I'll just keep an eye on him. I heard him walking. I heard her, her walking. That's a buck call. So give it a minute. You do a couple of those. I'm hoping that we get one here in just a second and we can actually see it going out this way and that way I know for a fact where it's going out in the clear. Just kind of listen. Not hearing nothing yet. Let's go ahead and spray some more uh, stuff on us too while we're at it. You just get to kind of listen for tracks. And I think that gunshot scared them all off. I'm not seeing a deer anywhere near, but the gun is so sensitive in this game. I could, every little movement I made, it was just flying all over the place. How long is the memory of this game? Well, at least you get to see a gun get fired. 
There's probably a dead deer laying over there somewhere that I need to go get, but I uh, could not. There's no tracking. There's no blood tracking. I guess they didn't want the game to have to be violent. I don't know. It's deer hunting. You don't. You always aim for their neck. You don't want to shoot them in the head because you want that for the trophy. You don't want to shoot them in the body because they'll just run off and you'll never find them. So just shoot them in the neck. It's, I don't get it. This is tough. Very, very tough. It is a game of patience and losing your deer. Um, I do not think we've got nothing coming out in this vicinity. I think the gunshot was too close to this, so let's get the crap out of here. I'm sorry, guys. I'm trying my best. It's the first time I've played this game. I tried it a little bit for a minute. But it doesn't mean that I played it long enough to figure out how to do I mean, I know the buttons for the most part, but I, I didn't ever run into a deer when I played it. I was just trying out the different shots. I shot the gun once, and I know how to do all that. I just, did we kill that deer? It, it don't show up on the GPS. It just shows us. And the ridges. But Kentucky might be one of the harder levels to do but if we're walking they run so we don't want to walk we want them to what about right here by this little area what about up there I like an, a big tree stand where we can hide I don't know if it'll let us it usually only lets us do little skinny trees Oh, yeah, it's going to let us. All right, we'll try this again. Go make us a tree stand up here. All right. Lock it into place and butt call. Now, I've, last time I had to listen for footsteps, I seen the deer walk right in front of me, but my gun is so terribly aimed. And I don't know if you can upgrade this stuff. I highly doubt in a game this cheap you can upgrade. The cool thing I like about this game is the tree stand. You can actually swing all the way around. Is it nighttime? No, it's daytime. Why does it look like it's nighttime down through there? Now, if we were bird hunting, I probably would have killed three or four by now. And I think I did kill a deer, but I didn't go get it for a trophy. I'm trying to get farther away from the gunshot so that way we can actually have a deer to kill but I think this episode may just be us oh there's one up there there's one up there alright see that out of control quit I see you Is he going to make it around this tree? I can't see him. Or her. Is there more? I mean, our opportunity to, to get one was right there in front of us. Literally. Right there in front of us. And now there's one walking. There he is. That's a buck. We're going to lose him. But they're coming back around, so we know that. So maybe another one will pop up here. A little closer to me than him. He was a distance, and there's a lot of bushes and trees in the way. 
if you can listen for the I just gotta get used to aiming I'm used to playing games that the I hear one which way is he at though right there right there he is See how sensitive? Trying to get it lined up at the neck. Got him! So we got us our first deer, guys. Nice. Let's go over here and check him out. I know exactly where you're at, buddy. Come on, get down the tree. This is exciting. We got one. We got him right in the neck, too. Right where I like to get. Let go. He should be right over here. Is he not right over here? Please don't lose this deer. He's in this vicinity. There he is. There he is. Nope, that is a tree stump. Where is my deer that I just killed? Was he not this way? These are all tree stumps. Oh my goodness. I will walk this whole area until we find that deer. I just don't remember. That's the problem is you the tree stand makes you go a certain way. So we'll just walk the outer perimeter. Hopefully we'll find him. I could have swore he was up this way. He was a distance, but he wasn't that far. There he is. Okay. Whew. I thought we lost him. Well, I guess they do have a little blood in this game. Uh, do you do anything with him? He's a first whitetail buck trophy earned. He's a buck. 123 Boone and Crockett. Weight 145. Harvested slash target inches 123 to 300. Is there anything we do? What do we do? What do you do when you kill one? I guess it you just you don't have to do nothing. It tells you the stats. You don't take him home. You don't cut his head off and make him a trophy. But this is our first deer, guys. This is our first deer we got. We got him right here in a tree stand. And almost lost him once we killed him. So we got him. Did we get him in the neck? Did we do a good shot? It looks like he died here, or he start, we shot him here and he made it to here before he collapsed. Um, poor thing. Anyhow, so there we go. We got us a deer, and that would be our first one ever. Now... We gotta get it a little bit farther distance. I like that we got one in Kentucky. They say that one's the hardest one to find them because of the trees and stuff. They say New Mexico's the easiest. But I wanna get away from where the gunshot noise could be heard and which scared all the other deer off. I'd like to get a bigger buck. If that's possible. We will find out. Okay, not knowing where I'm going here, just kind of going. I mean, I've got a map. I'm on the outer edges headed towards the fence line, but that's not good enough. I don't want to be at the edges. I don't feel like the game puts a bunch of deer at the edges of the border. Well, at least we got our first kill on this video, and that's nice. I didn't know if we even would, honestly. Let's climb up here. See how far it wants us to go up. 
Right here. Okay. You see anything yet? Nice frame droppage. Alright, guys. Let's call. I wouldn't have caught that buck had I not heard him do the same call I was doing. So you just gotta kinda watch what we're doing here. Uh, I think we should spray ourselves. And there we go. And go back to the grunt call. It's starting to get night time. I hear crickets. I don't see anything yet. I definitely do not see anything. Are we still too close to the gunshot of the other buck we killed? Do you guys think that we're too close? Or do you think it's getting too late? Ain't that when you hunt though? Because that's when they're always running across the road. Early in the morning, two and three in the morning. What's that up there? I'm just trying to get us one more good. I don't hear nothing. I don't see nothing. This might just be a bad area. Plus, it's getting late. So, if we hit start, we can exit this hunt on hunting, hunting level. The main reason I'm doing that is because I got the kill, and I want to check out Action Hunt in New Mexico. High altitude wilderness holding plenty of muley bucks. And I don't know about using a different rifle, because... This one is awful sway. So I may just try the 30-30 this time. Okay. Hunt venue objective. Kill 20 kills. Buck count double. Uh, so did it save our... Did it save our Kentucky one? Twenty kill okay, so basically it wants you to do twenty kills to get past the stages. Okay. Well, we're not going to do that. That would be that would t it took me almost an hour to do one kill. But we will continuously hunt and have fun doing it. Maybe one day I'll do a live stream to where we actually try to get the 20 kills, but until I get used to this game, that is definitely not going to happen. So it did not save probably the one kill that I got. But I don't know it may it may save it. I don't know. It may have an automatic save feature. It could have anything. I do not know nothing about this game at all. I just bought it because it was cheap. And I said I'm going to share it with my subscribers. Okay. Timer. Oh, this has actually got a timer on it. Look at that. Look at all these deer. Look at what is going on here. What is going Oh, this is action. This is what they're... Oh, okay, I get it. They want you... You can't move either. Okay, so action is a competitive thing. I am terrible at this gun. Look at these things just hopping around like they didn't even hear the gunshots. So this is action hunt. This is where you got one. Alright. Can we get two? Nope. Missed him. Oh, he turned around on me. Time remaining. We're a little lower than we want to be. Ah, oh, come on. I had him. We were still loading. Oh, 
Miss that guy. Come on. Guys, turn around. Do your little dance. Ah, oh, you gotta be kidding me. This is terrible shooting. I'm just too low. Got two. He's looking. Oh, this one's actually like, hey, I'm gonna look for a minute. Three. And this is gonna take 45 minutes for me to load my gun, which is, I should have just used the, uh, This one's awful close to be missing. Thank you. But it won't let you move, and that's kind of aggravating because they're getting farther away. I think they're doing that on purpose to make this tough with a time limit. They just kind of bounce back and forth, but they get farther and farther away the more you kill. Uh, Are they going to get any closer to me? Oh, there's one right in front of me. Standing there staring. Nope, he started moving. Terrible. I don't understand the flowy nate the flowy motion of these guns in this game is insanity. There's one close by. Bam. Why can I not get these? I got him in the rear. Come on. Got another one. Can we do it? We got plenty of time remaining. We ain't got much more to go, guys. They're a lot far. Oh, this one ain't that far. He's right here next to us. He just don't care that we're right here, obviously. Uh, didn't get him in the rear. I thought they were getting farther away, but then they kind of eased their way. Back. Got another one. Got another one. We need one more, guys. As we reload our weapon. Looks like we need one more. I didn't keep count. But these flowy weapons are not very fun. To play with. Got him. Good shooting. Advance to the next action hunting level. We got past stage one. So now, if I go to New Mexico, move this one right here, use the 30-30 rifle. Yes, we are on level two. So that is one way you can play this game. Or you can pro hunt and go to Kentucky, where you're predominantly big open hardwood, large cow pastures on this track, plenty of bucks chasing. So basically, you can just go out and have fun in an open world. Um, and harvested. We didn't harvest any. How do you harvest them? I killed one here, didn't I? Or is this a different? No, no, no. We, we killed one here. Yeah, he was 123. Okay, so it did save our kill. So that's good news. And we also have a different method of playing where we can just shoot 20 within a certain amount of time. So we'll do Oregon probably on the next video. Uh, we did Kentucky, and then we did the Action Hunt in New Mexico. Uh, targets, I've yet to figure out what that's about. Customize, I don't know what controller, I know that. What's customize? Customize of what? Vertical, uh, I'd like to turn that down if it means gun. If it means your gun, not, I guess we could turn that down a little bit. We'll see what that does next time. Enable HUD, sure. Invert pitch, no, we don't want to invert, no southpaw controls. So, okay, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. We got one kill in a pro hunt, a regular hunt, like you would do in real life. Then we went to an action hunt in New Mexico, killed 20 within a time limit. Level 1 went to level 2, so we'll keep moving on those levels. We'll do both in every video, or try to, unless we run out of time. Uh, 
I just wanted to do something different. We race, we play basketball, we play baseball, but I have never done hunting. Uh, I've done it in real life a long time ago when I was younger, but I've never done it on a video game. This is the first time. It was very cheap, as you can tell. I'd like to get a better hunting game for the channel. We will do that soon, but if anybody wanted to check out pro deer hunting out west, this is the place to be. So I hope you enjoyed the video, and I will see you guys here soon. Probably baseball next, if I had to guess. Thank you.